Hi, everybody. So I know it's been a crazy amount of time. Crazy things have been happening lately and we're like in the middle of the pandemic. And so I know it can be like a really scary time for a lot of people. Um, but I just wanted to jump on and give everybody some encouragement. Um, some things that you can do like while the pandemic is happening is, of course, what we've all been hearing is to stay inside, self-isolate, um, keep your hands clean, um, you know, spray Lysol, just clean, just be clean. And it's really crazy that like a pandemic has to happen for people to know how to be clean. You know, there's no cure for it. They're working on a cure for it. And it can actually, you know, be scary because some people have died from it. So um, I don't want to be insensitive at all. But um, some things that you can do, I would say primarily you should take your mind off of it as much as possible. Like, I'm not going to say don't pay attention to the news at all. Like, I still think that you should listen, you know, and see whatever updates are. But I would say not to um, be consumed by the news 24-7 for this because it's just going to add more um, anxiety to how you're, how we all are currently feeling. And so like just listen to maybe like one newscast, one update, and then just go about your daily life. So I know a lot of people are working from home. And so, um, you know, the best thing that you can do is to like schedule your day like you normally would, like still take a shower, still brush your teeth, um, you know, still work on whatever work that you have to work on to get completed throughout the day. But just you know, treat it as if you went outside and you went to work. So just try to get your work done. Try to set um, a plan and a schedule. Let me take my glasses off because I didn't know that circular thing was there. But yeah, um, just like have some sort of schedule so that you're able, um, you know, to stay consistent and get, still get work done. Um, also, if you have like a lot of free time, it's a really good time to invest in maybe an online course and just, you know, teach yourself um, something that, you know, you haven't really learned about, or you want to know more about, because they have a lot of avenues for that. Um, and you can just learn a new skill, like while you're waiting to give back, you can also catch up on that TV series that you've been neglecting for a very long time. Hey, Elijah. Um, so yeah, it's just like, just try to take your mind off of what's happening in the world, what can go wrong, like try not to think about what can go wrong, just, you know, pray, pray to God and okay, um, and just try to take your mind off it, try to still develop yourself, like don't sit stagnant and, you know, not uh, do anything, like I just finished doing a webinar, teaching a webinar about like how to create the perfect post. So like, if you're interested in that, you can comment below and I can send it to you. But it's really cool, like to learn different skills and be able to do that remotely. You don't have to show up to, you know, an outside class just to learn something like we literally have the internet at our fingertips. Like, I don't even know everything about investing. So like, it would, you know, be good for me to like, take this downtime and actually learn what's going on. <laughs> Hi, Eli. <laughs> yeah, so that was really what I wanted to say, like, as far as just like, you know, um, staying consistent, still being who you are, um, you know, love on your family, call your friends, you know, because like, we get busy so many times, like so much often, that like, we don't even catch up with anybody. And it'll be like days and weeks since we even talk to them, like, just call them and check on them and see how they're doing. Like, I prefer doing face chat anyway. So like, or FaceTime, um, <laughs> face to face chat, like that is what I love to do because it, it mimics, you know, the in-person feel for me. So that's why I typically video call my friends um, just so I can see their face, their sweet, lovely faces and to talk to them. So don't forget to still talk to people and, you know, still be on the map. Um, if you are following toxic people, unfollow them. If you're following, you know, a bunch of mess online, unfollow um, because you should be healthy while you're on social media because there's a lot of fake news out there in terms of this virus. Like people are just making up all these conspiracy theories and making up all this stuff that isn't factual and they're scaring people. So like if you see that, report it, like get it off so you can see if you can get it off. Hi, sis. How are you? 
Um, but yeah, just make sure that you're staying healthy online and you're, you know, keep me informed. So it's like, be in love with your life every minute of it. So like, you know, you can just write little notes to yourself and just post it on your wall. So that way, when you look, you go back and look at it, you can be like, yeah, I'm encouraged by that. Like take this time, you know, to plan out the rest of your month. How is the rest of your month going to go? Um, you know, plan out what you want to do. What has been something that you've just been putting off, like putting off for like days and months because you're like, oh, I have to go to work. Oh, I have to do this. I have to do this. I have to take care of this first. Like, don't delay on like going after your dreams just because something has happened. Like, this is how you deal with things that like when they happen, when you're forced to like stay home, when you're forced to like, you know, sit down and, you know, wait for something to be over. You can be doing so much more stuff um, in order to develop yourself spiritually and naturally. So that is just what I wanted, um, you know, to offer to my community. Um, today is just like, you know, really invest in yourself. Like even when stuff goes back to normal or willing, like invest in yourself. Don't put off things just because you let other things get in your way. Like, yes, we're going to get distracted. And yes, there are a lot of times um, when things take precedence over what we want to do, but you don't want to keep delaying it for the rest of your life. Like you want to be able to indulge in stuff that is going to make you and yourself a lot better. So that's all I wanted to say. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Um, come back to this video um, if you need any more encouragement. And I hope you guys have a good day.